What's up guys, Aaron Productions here, and today we're going to be doing a bedroom system test 3. So, that's my demonstration system, of course, which is on the wall. I mean, the fake wall. With my flush mount, Siemens, um, what's it called? The mini horn strobe. I can't remember the model number. BG-8, I mean, I've had that there forever. I'm not sure why I haven't changed it yet. But next time you probably see the system will probably be the BG-8 or something. Sorry if I was talking a little fast or was running out of breath. But the only thing that's really changed in this system besides the alarm is I put my system sensor I3 there so we could test it with um, a testing stick. Then there's my Simplex smoke detector. Of course we need to test everything on the system because there's not a lot to show. So here we go. Mm, weird that it's making that warbling sound. Now that I think of it, it's on the wheel up thing. Let me go fix that. So while I did that, I also said on tip of recording, so let's retry. Yeah, that alarm does not like being coded that way. <laughs> It's not that bad, but I could really hear it through my hearing protection. Okay, so let's reset. And of course, I have no batteries. And here, I know I could have took in the batteries that I used for my panel. But now, um, let's test the smoke detector with, I mean, the i3 with something. Okay, so, there we go. Bam. And, forgot that. It's on verification. Here we go. There we go. I don't like having that alarm on for too long because it's too much like a smoke alarm. Um, so for fun, let's just activate both zones. Okay, reset to. Watch that go off. Okay. So now let's test that smoke detector. Test it with fire. Okay, let's take this head down. Oops. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that's going to be it for this system test. Let's reset. Okay. So now, guys, it's time to say peace out.